All right, what's going on guys, guys, that is here. So everyone knows about the zero cutter. Well, basically everyone does. It was a melee weapon released into the game that shouldn't have been released and everyone thinks that you can't get it anymore, but hear me out, there's a way to still do it. Now, I forget who told me this. It was more than likely Oscar. Oscar seems to know everything about the game at this point, but there's a way to still get the zero cutter and the fire axe. Now, when you go to your melees, if you go through here and you look, Zero Cutter isn't on here, right? It's not supposed to be in the game, and it wasn't supposed to be before, but there is still a way to get it. Let me show you. So here's what we're going to do. You're going to go to your case inventory, and now normally if you open up a case, like let me open up one right here, I'm not going to get a legendary, but if you get a legendary, it's the only ones that you can normally get that are on your list. However, if you go to trade-ins, where you trade in red skins, now I'm on a private server, so don't worry about me trading in my Costanza skins, we go here and we submit a trade in i don't know if you'll be able to see it here but if you watch closely there will be the zero cutter and the fire axe there's a the fire axe there's the morning star which you can get as well and there's the zero cutter so let me see i'm probably not going to get it right now because i tried this for literally half an hour the other day and i just have no luck it's possible to get it if it wasn't possible it wouldn't be on the list however i'm trying to get it to show in kind of a still frame where you guys are able to see it pretty easy or at least a lot easier than before yeah see there's a fire axe there's the zero cutter you're able to still get them now i'm on a private server so even if i got them right now they wouldn't save however it is possible still to get these these are they're still in the game even though they're not supposed to be it's still possible to get them now when you get them because they aren't in weapon loadout here's how you're going to equip them now i don't have one at the moment because i'm too lazy to go open up a million cases because as you can see my inventory lags but when you get them you're gonna go to your case inventory Go to your normal inventory, ignore this, close out of that. When you come here, you know how you can see you have, let me scroll through all my cases, you have melee skins, right? If you come here, the zero cutter, the fire axe, or the morning star will be in here if you unlock it. And to do it, you left click on it, and then you have to equip this skin, because it won't be in your normal melee spot. So let's say that I want, just to show you that like you can do it from here, let's say my tactical spatula, I want Pepe on it, right? And we're going to go here. But when you do this, you don't actually have to equip the skin. If you just go ahead and do tax bat, now I have the tactical spatula unlocked and it's in my hands. Same thing for the zero cutter, same thing for the morning star, same thing for the fire axe. Pretty cool thing. Obviously, I'm too lazy to do that and like so my inventory lags terribly. Like if I F5 right now and show you guys like me opening a case, if I can go back to the start of my inventory, like even going through my inventory, look how laggy it is. I'm going to spam left click on this. Do you see how long it takes to open just one case? It's too much for me. But nonetheless, that's how you unlock hidden melees in Phantom Forces. I hope you guys enjoyed. Just a quick video for today. But I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.